We often envision dinosaurs as colossal beasts, creatures that would have been as magnificent as they were terrifying. However, dinosaurs manifested in an astonishing variety of sizes and shapes. Today, we turn the spotlight onto some of the most diminutive dinosaurs known to have ever existed. We will uncover their identities and explore the details we know about these miniature titans. To begin, we've selected 10 fascinating specimens, though the world of dinosaurs was brimming with intriguing creatures. So if we've overlooked a dinosaur you're curious about, please let us know in the comments. Let's commence with a somewhat controversial inclusion. If avian dinosaurs are counted among the smallest, then technically we should start with the bee hummingbird. All modern birds can be classified as dinosaurs, and this tiny creature holds the title of the smallest living bird. In the words of Julia Clark, associated with North Carolina State University and the North Carolina Museum of Natural Sciences, birds are just one lineage of dinosaurs that happen to survive to the present. This minuscule bird measures just 5 centimeters in length and weighs a mere 2 grams. Found in Cuba, their nests are approximately 1 inch long and cradle eggs the size of individual coffee beans. The first extinct dinosaur on our roster is Anchionis huxleyi. With its long legs and short feathered body estimates suggest Anchionis huxleyi weighed between 100 to 700 grams and measured 34 to 40 centimeters in length. The fossils of this dinosaur provide scientists with clues regarding its coloration. It is thought to have been predominantly dark gray and black, highlighted by striking white stripes on its wings and a small red patch on its head. Perhaps unsurprisingly, the name Anchionis means near bird. While Huxley pays homage to Thomas Henry Huxley, one of the pioneering biologists who first proposed the link between birds and dinosaurs. Scientists have pieced together information from a partially preserved adult fossil to learn more about Epidexipteryx hui, another diminutive dinosaur on our list. A lightweight at just over 160 grams, this was a small yet impressive dinosaur distinguished by long ornamental tail feathers approximately three times the length of its tiny body. Overall, this petite creature measures about 44.5 centimeters in total length. If you wish to learn more about Epidexipteryx hui and its peculiar yet fascinating family tree, please check out our video on Yichi, which is linked above. Next, let's meet the miniature dinosaur, Mei Long. Mei Long is one of the most remarkable fossils ever discovered. The fossil was preserved in a sleeping posture, its face nestled into a wing-like arm, a position strikingly similar to that of modern-day roosting birds. This would have been a duck-sized dinosaur. The well-preserved juvenile specimen, found in the Chinese province of Liaoning, measured 53 centimeters long. Mei Long lived approximately 125 million years ago during the Cretaceous period. Swift on its feet, it likely preyed on small lizards and insects on the floor of its forest habitat. Volcanic activity was frequent within this habitat, meaning many fossils from this location and time period have been exceptionally preserved in volcanic ash. The probable cause of death for this small sleeping juvenile Mei Long was carbon monoxide poisoning before its body was covered and preserved by ash. The subsequent extinct dinosaur on our list is Mahakala Omnogovai. Assuming Amnokovi is a typo for Omnogovi, which was about 70 centimeters long, this smaller dinosaur would have lived approximately 80 million years ago. Mahakala was a small raptor and possibly adopted a semi-aquatic lifestyle, or at the very least likely resided near water sources. Living life as a smaller dinosaur necessitates staying close to home to avoid vulnerability to predatory threats. Mahakala inhabited the Jadokta Formation common spelling for Dadocha, which was a hot and arid desert at the time. A limited number of oases in the area would have provided a hospitable habitat. Next on our list is a case of a long-named small dinosaur, Micropachycephalosaurus, which translates to small, thick-headed lizard, an apt description for this creature. This dinosaur would have been similar in size to Mahakala, measuring around 60 to 70 centimeters. This smaller dinosaur would have had to depend on agility and speed to navigate the landscape of the late Cretaceous period. When this dinosaur was discovered, it was initially believed to be the smallest pachycephalosaur ever found. Pachycephalosaurs are renowned for their tough, bony heads, hence the meaning behind the name Micropachycephalosaurus. However, over time, the classification of this dinosaur has come under scrutiny. 
Only one incomplete fossil was discovered in China by Dong Jiming, and all classifications and studies have stemmed from this single specimen. Some experts believe Micropachycephalosaurus may have actually been a small ceratopsian, the plant-eating beaked dinosaurs characterized by a large bony frill at the back of their heads. Eventually, Micropachycephalosaurus was classified as a ceratopsian in 2011. Conversely, the skulls of young pachycephalosaurs changed as they matured, so for some researchers, the jury is still out on this dinosaur's true identity. As well as being one of the first feathered dinosaurs to be discovered, Microraptor Zhaoyanus, common spelling for Zhaoyanus, was also smaller compared to its family members like Velociraptor and Deinonychus. Covered in feathers on their arms and legs, it is believed they would have grown to around 1.2 meters in length. If a person of average height took one and a half steps, that distance would represent the size of this dinosaur. Discoveries of pigment cells in Microraptor remains allow us to infer it was black in color possibly resembling a modern starling or blackbird. While paleontologists often struggle to piece together the puzzle from incomplete and degraded fossils, Microraptor specimens have been somewhat of a blessing. Over 300 fossils of this species have been found suggesting it was a relatively common dinosaur. No list of smallest dinosaurs would be complete without mentioning Compsognathus longipes. For an extended period, this turkey-sized dinosaur at about one meter in length and weighing between 0.8 and 3.5 kilograms was recognized as the smallest dinosaur ever found. This diminutive dinosaur was a theropod like its gigantic relative, the Tyrannosaurus rex, and it roamed the landscapes of Germany and France 150 million years ago. The next small dinosaur on our list possesses a name that reveals much about it. Parvicursor remotus, meaning small runner or slender runner, is a significant contender for the title of smallest dinosaur. It may have been only about 38 centimeters in length and weighed between 168 and 170 grams lighter than most bags of sugar. However, it is crucial to note that all our knowledge about Parvicursor remotus is derived from limited resources, specifically an incomplete specimen consisting of legs and a pelvis dating from about 72 million years ago. Finally, let us meet Bambiraptor. A small yet fierce hunter that was 70 centimeters in length, 30 centimeters in height, and weighed a mere 2 kilograms. This dinosaur was discovered by a 14-year-old boy in 1993 who unearthed the fossil on his family's ranch in Montana. In addition to being a new species, the fossil is almost complete, which makes this accidental discovery quite astounding. Researchers have dated this fossil to the late Cretaceous period. It featured a sharp middle claw ready to prey on small mammals. The Bambaraptor could run at speeds comparably horrible to a modern chicken. The Bambaraptor belongs to a group of dinosaurs called Dromaeosauridae, formal family name for Dromaeosaurus, which were flightless dinosaurs covered in feathers. It will likely come as no surprise that this group of dinosaurs may be closely related to modern birds. Just as it is challenging to definitively classify the largest dinosaur, it is also tricky to pinpoint the smallest. Methods for obtaining accurate measurements of size and weight can be problematic especially when dealing primarily with incomplete fossils. And while scientists employ various methods to predict the size and weight of dinosaurs, formulating educated guesses, there is always an inherent degree of uncertainty in paleontology. Sometimes fossils can mislead paleontologists. This occurred with Mosaurus, whose name means mouse lizard. This name, as we will see, is not entirely appropriate. In the 1970s, researchers in Argentina discovered very small bones leading them to introduce Mosaurus to the world. However, later discoveries revealed that this supposedly tiny dinosaur could grow to significant sizes with some adult specimens weighing as much as 113 kilograms. It is likely that paleontologists were initially misled by the bones of juvenile dinosaurs. We cannot fault scientists for this misinterpretation. Identifying smaller dinosaurs can be considerably more challenging than identifying larger species. Those of you who are dinosaur superfans may be wondering about the absence of Oculudentavis congri, common spelling for congri on this list. This small fossil encased in amber was initially celebrated as the smallest dinosaur fossil ever found when its discovery was announced in March 2020. Researchers described it as a hummingbird-sized avian dinosaur with small teeth. In fact, it would have been comparable in size to the bee hummingbird. 
Upon closer examination, researchers could discern a large round eye and a sharp beak-like snout within a skull measuring only 7 millimeters long. News outlets and the scientific community were captivated by this peculiar-looking fossil. People were excited about the potential insights this fossil could offer regarding the evolutionary link between birds and dinosaurs. But to temper expectations, new research has confirmed this specimen is neither a dinosaur nor a bird. The new evidence is so compelling that the scientific journal which first published the paper on its supposed discovery as the tiniest dinosaur ever found has now retracted the original publication. Nature issued a statement indicating their desire to prevent inaccurate information from persisting in scientific literature. This tiny discovery is probably a strange-looking small reptile that existed at least 99 million years ago. Since its initial discovery, a second specimen of this species has been found. With this new discovery comes more opportunities to research the specimen, thereby confirming that this was not a dinosaur. Paleontologist Susan Evans has spearheaded research into this specimen and has been quoted as saying, you've got this weird big-eyed kind of crested nose thing that certainly doesn't at first look like a lizard. It's weird, but it's a lizard. Identifying fossils is a difficult endeavor, and this certainly isn't the first, nor will it be the last time something has been mistakenly identified as a dinosaur. Overall, we hope this video has demonstrated that dinosaurs do not have to be ginormous or terrifying to be interesting and significant to the world of paleontology. Which dinosaur from today's list is your favorite? Let us know in the comments. Like this video, Share it with those who still hear the past whisper and subscribe to Echoes of the Ancients where lost worlds speak again.